how to effectively promote your business on social media. Social media is the number one platform where we all have it as entrepreneurs, where we can make a lot of money and this is how you can promote your business. Now, number one, doubling down into two social media accounts. Having everything for your business can never work. You have this, you have this, you have LinkedIn, Instagram, you have Twitter, YouTube, whatever. It's okay. You can have all those. Personally, I have almost every social media, but I don't use all of them. I'm very poor on uh, Twitter. I'm very poor on LinkedIn. I'm very poor on other places, but I'm very active on Facebook, Instagram, Sorry, I'm very, very uh, serious, specifically on YouTube, but as well, my YouTube is doing very well and Instagram is doing very well. But if you're um, a budding entrepreneur, an upcoming entrepreneur, kindly just have two. Have two which are very, very, very basic and the main, main ones. Why? Because you'll be able to narrow down your strength in some place whereby you can promote yourself even much more. For example, take Facebook and take Instagram or take Instagram and take YouTube or take maybe the three if you really have the muscles depending on how bigger you're growing and you will see that you've put all your energy in in a specific social media area and uh, with this energy being concentrated in one area, your promotion and your marketing becomes much more easier. So how do you do it? You should always have a long and a short video platform. Most probably a short video platform should be Instagram, if you're good on Instagram, or can be Facebook, and the long one can be YouTube, or maybe the short one can be Instagram and the longer one can be uh, Facebook or Twitter or whichever, depending with you, with all where your interest is. But the shorter one will help you put on the trailer, like the short version of your video and what exactly you need to put for like like an introduction of how the main video will be so that one is a very important thing and the main area platform will put in the main video whereby all your views will come from and all those kind of things so try and double down into two social media accounts or three if you really need to do much number two give value and more value value and more value and more value at first do not think money just think value the reason many entrepreneurs keep on failing in their niche and in their business is because they don't think the value they think about the money you start a youtube channel today and you're already thinking about how much you will earn how much you'll gain from ads you're already sending people to different links and sending open this link open that link who is going to open how do they even know you do they even trust you in the first place before they even trust the product let people get the value let them understand who you are let them get to know you better and understand and feel you even much more and after they feel you now you can start slowly transitioning yourself into becoming now a real-time entrepreneur and selling your product or selling your affiliate or selling your branding or whichever thing that you may be wanting to sell but first don't sell products or sell services give people value let them trust you let them build a community within you and around you and after that people will start loving you because they hate ads people hate advertisements people hate uh, being pushed into things that they don't want but they will enjoy being pushed there by someone that they already love number three mix both soft and hard promotion soft and hard promotion do not always sell a product in every video that you that you post just tell information give information don't always send people to some places all the time sending people here sending click that link hit that the uh, of course notification button i always say that so much eh? forget about that point but now don't always send people somewhere hit here hit here follow me here do that no just sometimes just do a video and that, that's it 
and let people judge for themselves. If they like you, they're going to go to that link that you're sending them. If they like you, they're going to go to the place that you're telling them. Eh? Let people see your brand at times. Let it sink. For example, Coca-Cola. How many times have you seen a Coca-Cola uh, written somewhere? They're not really forcing you go into that shop and buy a Coca-Cola bottle. No, you just seeing a Coca-Cola here, Coca-Cola there. It just rings in your mind the way we have Safaricom here in Kenya. Every place you will see Safaricom touching lights, Safaricom doing this, but they're not telling you go and buy credit. Why? Because they know the more they are in your mind, out of sight, out of mind, yes, but the more they're in your mind without even telling, pushing you towards something, the moment they will tell you now, we have a Safaricom activation. Oh, it's the same guys that you've seen helping people. It's the same guys that you've seen doing this project. It's the same guys you've seen here and there. So people are going to buy your product because they've always seen you even when you did not sell them anything. Hope you're going uh, together on this point. Huh? Number four, capitalize on micro-influencers. Who are micro-influencers? These are smaller, small guys in the industry who are also doing something similar to you. These are guys who can promote you and they are, they are ready maybe to promote promote versus another promotion. Maybe you mentioned their channel, they mention yours, they have 5,000 subscribers. Maybe they don't even have more or 10,000 or 1,000 or whichever. They can promote you. Imagine if you have 10 guys who are 5,000, 5,000 subscribers, who you say they are small, how much mileage are you going to get when they promote you in their channels? You're going to get a lot. And even some other guys, they'll just tell you, hey, buy me some coffee. You know, in Kenya, when you say coffee, you mean a thousand bob. Eh? That, that's for you. You have to understand. Buy me some coffee, 1,000, 2,000 bob, and people are going to mention you all over. There's another trick that I always see. There are companies which really, really, really struggle so much with advertisement. And I tell them, why should you be rushing? I'm not I'm not being biased on Citizen and NTV and all these big TV stations. But these big TV stations, they're already too big that they already have the muscles and you cannot be able to afford them even when you want to do an advertisement. Why not go to a small TV like uh, Switch TV, which one? Which, all these small, small KU TV, whichever. Go place your advertisement there. Do you know how many people watch those TV stations? Very many. Just go and see the producer. Talk to him. Tell him, hey, have an advertisement here. I need you to promote this one for me. I need you to put this and blah, blah, blah. Just the way you're going to do it. These small guys are going to make a big mileage for you. If you have five TV stations promoting your thing, five radio stations, the small, small ones promoting your thing, Five newspapers and magazines which are small promoting the same thing. Online guys here and there promoting the same thing. All that budget that you've used would have been used by just one TV station, maybe for just a day. And this 10, 10, 10, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5 you've been able to use a smaller, even a half the budget and been able to reach so many people. Because trust you me, the world is liberal. We have so many people watching different areas. Gone are the days when we were forced to watch KBC and all the time to Kufurais, to Kufurais. Now we are done with that. What we always watch is what you like. I like watching this small station. I have a favorite program there. That's what I'm going to watch. At 7 p.m., I don't need to watch news. I want to go and watch Desago making some jokes somewhere. That's what I'm going to watch. I like seeing maybe another guy there, whoever. It's a liberal world. It's, it's, it's a very unique world nowadays. And people have their favorite areas because gone are the days when you could be pushed in one area. So use small influencers to grow your business. Let them talk about your business. Let them tell other people why they need to buy from you. And the more the people, less than the budget, you're going to see magic. And the final point on how to effectively promote your business on social media is know exactly who you target. Know who your client is. Who is your client? Who is your client? Do you know the specific client that you should be talking to? Are you just everywhere? Don't be too wide. When you're too wide everywhere, you're here, you're selling pineapples, you're selling shoes, you're selling laptops, you're selling this. You look like a con man. Everybody looks at you in your social media platform and today you're selling laptops. The other day you have a fruit parlor. The other day you're selling shoes. The other day you're doing this. 
come on, don't be too wide because people are going to think this is a con man, this is a con woman. He doesn't really understand. You can be a master of everything. Yes, you can know something about almost everything, but you can be a master of everything. So understand your field. And when you concentrate your energy, people are going to like you more and they're going to buy from you. Calculate, concentrate your strength. Where is your strength? Concentrate it so much. I always talk to my producer, it's called Steve, and all the time I tell him that when he concentrates in video editing and so much, he always comes up with different ideas every time. Every day he's telling me, come on, I have this idea, I have this idea. Now think of it, he was a video producer. Here is writing a magazine. Here is on editing this, is on driving. Is on. No, come on, it can't happen like this. Concentrate your ideas. Concentrate your ideas. And if it's the first time, that you're watching us on YouTube or Facebook or Instagram. Kindly, we have a YouTube channel, Keith Muoki. Kindly subscribe and hit that notification button so that you don't miss a video because this year is going to be greater, greater than even last year and bigger is the next year which is about to come. So kindly subscribe, hit that notification button so that you don't miss a video and share, comment and like the video if it makes you feel something or it opens up your mind in one way or another. God bless you and have a great, great time. I love you guys.